Okay, here we are. We're at the gym. I've got my hair back so that um, it won't bother me when I'm doing stuff. But you can really see then that there's a lot of puffy there and stuff like that. So, anyway, um, just going to let you know I'm taking my water. And I love these Voss ones because they are glass. Um, there for a little while they went to plastic and I, I think it was about three months they figured out maybe people didn't like that so well. Um, I was also going to show you this is the kind of little headset I have. It's just a little cheap one off of Amazon. It goes around your neck. Um, so you don't have that big cord and it's, it's wireless. So you don't have that big cord going um, from your phone to your headset. And it's a lot less irritating when you're trying to work out and stuff. Um, it's about 6.30. So hopefully a lot of people are already been here and left. I don't go to a very big gym. It is a 24 hour gym, but it's not a great big one. Um, they have the free weights and a lot of machines. They have like a separate room where if you wanted to go in there and you do yoga or ride bikes and stuff, you can. Um, but I mainly go in there and do the machines and uh, the elliptical. So that's what I'm planning on doing. Um, I'm going to go ahead and use my Samsung Health app to start tracking more frequently so that I'm keeping track of that. I'm also going to use it for uh, tracking my nutrition because it does, it is a good app to give you like the whole breakdown of your percentages of nutrients. Like um, it'll even do your sodium and potassium, your carbohydrates and proteins and fats, of course. Uh, it'll go through quite a bit of detail, so to be free, it's pretty good. Uh, that's what I also use to track my steps, and I track my exercise and stuff on it. So I'm going to be trying to be a lot more faithful about using that. Um, most of the time lately, in the last couple of months, I've started drinking water out of a gallon jug. Um, I quit doing that for about two weeks and was back using just um, the liters and I found that my water intake dropped dramatically. I don't know if it's some kind of subconscious thing that oh well I'm just going to take a sip because I'm going to run out and then I'll have to go fill it back up or, or open a new one or whatever. So whatever it is for me and I, I have seen other people too that carrying that gallon it may look a little silly but you're getting your water in um, and I do refill my bottles that I use even the gallon ones I usually will refill once um, these Voss ones since they're glass I do wash them and refill them a few times um, so it's a really inexpensive way to get a nice glass water bottle so you don't have any of that plastic issue stuff to worry about. So I guess we'll go ahead and go in the gym and I'm planning on doing an hour. I think I'll do, I haven't been in a while, so um, I'm gonna do about 30 minutes of weights and 30 minutes on the elliptical and then we'll go from there. And I'll try to, um, post what the Samsung Health says and things like that about how many calories that burns and everything. Um, I'm not going to push real hard, honestly, because I've probably gone twice or three times a month in the last, sad to say, five or six months. I haven't been going really at all, and that's, that's not going to work. And one thing I did want to share with you that I saw on... Um, the Discovering Health website, well, it's um Facebook page, that my health coach from uh, Take Shape for Life had put me in when I started ordering through them. Because the first month, I ordered from Metafast, just direct from their website, all that. And then she contacted me, and I went ahead and switched over to Take Shape for Life, and ordered twice from it, but that's, that's going to be the end of it. I just 
have other places that I want to put my money. And, um, you know, the, the packaged food. But again, great place to start. Get you off on the right foot. You see some results and it makes you happy to do that. So it, it gets you motivated. So it definitely does have a purpose. Uh, I still have loads and loads of food left. We'll make another video about that some at some point. Um, and I'll, I'll share my experience with that. Um, so I will be using that food till it's gone. Um, but I am going to go ahead and incorporate fresh home cooked food that's low carb. And uh, we'll kind of go from there. Okay. So I'm going to go in. Oh, I almost dropped the phone. Sorry. I don't know how to edit. So this is how it's going to be a while. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go in and do the gym. If there's not a lot of people in there, I may record a little bit just so you can kind of see which machines and how much weight I'm going to go ahead and start off with today and things like that. So, but if there's a lot of people in there, I don't want to invade anybody's privacy or make anyone uncomfortable by um, recording while they're trying to work out. I, I know if it was me, I wouldn't like that very much. So we definitely don't want to intrude on anybody, but I'm sure there will be opportunities when there'll be nobody there but me. So, okay. Well, um, Thanks for watching again, and thanks for putting up with the shaky camera and the almost dropping of the camera and everything else that you are kind enough to kind of go through with me. So I'll talk to you again soon. Thanks. Bye.